I am, I would say a three because I don't feel that I have gotten everything across to my students that I need to get across to them. There's so much more that I wanna do with them and I will miss my students dearly. But I'm excited to stay at home with my family and to be able to celebrate the birth of Christ. I love it. And why I love it? I'm ready for Christmas break. I'm ready for a time to just get, go home, relax, go do some wrestling practices and prepare for the spring semester. 10. No, I'm just playing. Um, I guess I'm kind of in between, you know, like Christmas break really comes with uh, a lot of shopping and having to do a lot of chores and stuff around the house, family coming together. So that's the fun part. But um, I think if it was uh, based off of uh, how much work I got to get to these kids, I'm, I'm probably about a five, six. Uh, you know, we got to go to reach. So uh, definitely want to keep going. But um, I know the kids need a break. So I'll, I'm going to stick with the 10 for sure. I am 10 ready. I am so ready to just spend some time uh, with my friends and family and maybe travel a little bit and of course I'll miss my students. On a scale of through 1 to 10, how ready are you for Christmas break and more? Um, I'll probably be a 10 and because all the presents and all the food and all the decorations. On a scale of 1 to 10, definitely a 10. I'm so tired of tests and school. I just want the cold to be over. I would probably say a 10 because I don't really like school in general, so, yeah. A 10, and why is to get out of school and have a break from it, finally? A 5, and the reason why, um, hang out with family and friends and stay in. Welcome to this week's sports schedule. Uh, Caven Wrestling is having a tournament in Reno, Nevada on December 17th through the 18th. Cave Girl Basketball has three games, December 13th, 14th, and 17th. On the 13th, they're having a game against Centennial in Las Cruces. On the 14th, they're having one against Goddard in Carlsbad. On the 17th, they're going against Las Cruces High in Carlsbad. Cave and Basketball is having three games, December 14th, 16th, and 17th. On December 14th, they're going against El Paso, Coronado in Carlsbad. On December 16th, they're going against Loving in Carlsbad. And December 17th, they're going against Las Cruces High in Las Cruces. Now for the eSports interview with Coach Butts. Hello, my name is Coach Butts. I am the eSports coach here at CHS. Uh, currently, we have about 10 gamers. Uh, we game in Rocket League and League of Legends. Right now, we have about six who play League of Legends and four or five who play Rocket League. Um, we also have the opportunity to participate in Smite, um, but we're kind of struggling on finding members for Smite, not really a game we play in Carlsbad. Um, so the way the season works for eSports, we have a fall exhibition season where we play schools from Canada, California, Colorado, New Mexico, all over the western central United States. And in the spring, we play in the New Mexico Activities Association State Championship, where we play a full schedule against New Mexico schools, uh, just like any other sport. And we compete for a state title at the end of the semester, and in hopes of going to national championship uh, towards the end of, of the semester, towards the summer. Uh, we're looking to improve our team morale by implementing and having uh, game nights, pizza parties, things of that sort. Um, and we really like to just come in every day after school and just have a good time playing games. Um, and we also like to win. So we do a lot of practicing every single day um, and we, we participate and play serious when it's game time. Hi guys, welcome to this week's school news. So today we are looking for new players for the eSports team on campus. We're looking for people who play League of Legends and Rocket League. We're going to be starting the official season soon. They're going to need all players of all skill levels, so come and join them at room 502. If you need to, contact Coach Butts. And now, Christmas on the Pecos. It will be through November 29th through the 31st of December. They won't be having anything on Christmas Eve. Tickets will range from $15 to $20 for adults and $10 to $15 for children. 
And while you're waiting to watch the Dazzling Light Show, make sure you check out the area. They'll be having food and drinks and many different things. Ho, 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 ho!